Hi and welcome to this month's editorial video where we're discussing and covering virtual reality and augmented reality in the hospitality industry. So what is virtual reality? VR is a computer generated simulation of an environment that allows a person to fully submerge themselves into a different world, a virtual world. VR is so effective because it has the ability to affect the five human senses that stimulate the brain to the point that it convinces the person experiencing it that it is actually participating in the event created by the computer. VR is currently most utilized in the gaming and entertainment industries, but it is starting to create some waves within our industry. Virtual reality is one of the biggest emerging technologies and the business world is also starting to come to terms with the number of opportunities that it can provide. For our industry, virtual reality can offer another level of customer engagement simply because it can digitally transport potential customers to a hotel or travel destination and allow them the opportunity to get an idea of what their experience will be like whilst there. Augmented reality is often compared to virtual reality, but while VR replaces the real world environment with a completely virtual one, augmented reality enhances the real world environment in real time. AR is an integration of the real world and the virtual world, with the aim of providing additional information about something in the real world with information displayed in the virtual world. For instance, a person could look at a painting in a museum in the real world, hold up their smartphone or tablet in front of that painting and see on the screen any further additional information, thus augmenting reality. AR can be experienced in a number of ways, including through smartphones, tablet devices and headsets. And what it does is introduce the digital components into a person's reality rather than replacing the reality itself. And this happens by overlaying visual information over a live picture of a person's physical environment. So in its basic form, augmented reality adds physical graphics to an environment when viewed through a device, altering the appearance of the environment itself or making the environment more interactive. A good example is Pokemon Go which was an open mobile multiplayer AR based game that when released in July of 2016 literally took the world by storm. A game where players collected points by walking around in the real world while holding up their smartphone in a quest to find catch and collect in their phone camera view virtual characters called pocket monsters which are located and linked to specific geographical locations. By April 2017 it had more than 65 million players and became the most successful game of all time. Pokemon Go was one of the first mainstream examples of augmented reality presented to us through a gaming scenario. Its success has now led to greater usage of that technology in other disciplines. The hospitality industry is now starting to find innovative ways of applying AR to improve the overall experience of staying in a hotel. Development in the virtual reality world is creating new, affordable, sophisticated hardware that renders highly realistic, immersive experiences. Some travel and tourism experts have wondered whether realistic VR experiences may one day replace the real thing and stop people from actually traveling. I personally don't believe it will, unless we are restricted of course from travel entirely by an event such as COVID-19. Like all new emerging technologies, VR and AR should be seen as an opportunity to elevate the experience for hotel guests and help hospitality outlets gain a competitive advantage. There are potentially five key ways virtual reality can be applied within the hospitality industry. Even though virtual reality experiences are getting increasingly immersive, they still aren't a match for the actual real life experience. People still very much prefer the real deal, whether that's an African safari, visiting Egyptian ruins, or sitting on picturesque sandy beaches in Asia. People would rather book a flight and have the real experience than simply visualize it via a virtual reality headset. Research has shown that experiencing a destination via virtual reality usually makes the user even more inclined to visit the destination or attraction in person and get the real feel. Virtual hotel tours. Looking at this through the marketing department's eyes, virtual hotel tours can provide the most relevant use for virtual reality. 
Traditionally, the hospitality industry has relied on videos or static images of their product to attract clients. Imagery is still a powerful selling point for our industry, so the more captivating the images are, the higher the probability of generating a conversion. One of the primary benefits of VR in this industry is to offer a try before you buy option. The immersive nature of VR enables everyone to experience a virtual version of a hotel room, attraction or unique selling point. VR offers a much more immersive pre-booking experience, certainly more than simply viewing images or reading customer reviews. Customers today usually require lots of information before they decide on booking a hotel room. Hotels can significantly shorten the process of research and seeking information by using VR. VR experiences not only offer an effective way to show customers how their stay could look, but also gives greater consumer confidence before arriving at the purchasing decision. Virtual booking processes. It is now possible to implement a virtual booking process where a user enters into a virtual environment, tours and reviews the product and is able to make a booking inside virtual reality. It's another way to boost conversions with the help of VR. VR booking processes have already been implemented by travel technology providers such as Amadeus, which offers a VR platform where customers can search for and book flights, hotel rooms, and even compare prices through VR to get the best rates. It seems to still be in the project phase and not widely distributed. However, the intent is there to move the booking ecosystem to the next level. Possible upselling opportunities could also be applied for upgrading to a suite by looking at additional amenities, a great view and all the additional comforts and spaciousness that a suite room can provide. Virtual reality training for hospitality staff. When it comes to staff training, hotels could offer real feel scenarios that help employees enhance soft skills during guest interaction and service. The technology is at its early stage in the industry, however it may not be too long before it really starts to make an impact in these areas. Virtual reality training could also be a powerful recruitment tool for the hotel industry. VR staff training could help the reduction in time spent in onboarding and training new hires, helping reduce the cost of acquiring new hires in an industry where the employee turnover is very high. It helps to have a system that streamlines staff recruitment and rapidly gets new employees on board. As you can see from the video playing now, small luxury hotels have implemented such a training tool for their hotels. Virtual reality entertainment. Entertainment has always played an important part of some specific hospitality packages. Apart from providing TVs in rooms with various channels, some establishments also go out of their way to offer their guests authentic entertainment experiences, including music, live bands, and various other kinds of performances. In the future, part of the entertainment package could be rendered in virtual reality. Various amounts of content could be included to create an amazing virtual reality experience, even in the most ordinary of environments. For now, one of the main challenges for hotels would be the high cost of acquiring the needed number of headsets for the guests. In closing, virtual reality applications in the hospitality industry can be broadly divided into these five areas. The technology is still in its early days. Adopters in the industry are still trying to determine which aspects of the tech will be the best fit for them, especially when it comes to meeting staff training needs and elevating the guest's experience. There are also business considerations to keep in mind when it comes to deploying VR. Can the costs be justified? Will a virtual reality investment improve a business's bottom line? What will be the acceptance arc of the technology? Will it go mainstream in a big way or will it stay as a novelty product used mainstream by techies and gamers. In spite of all the uncertainties and financial hurdles, VR could still have a significant impact on the operations of hotels and other players in the hospitality industry. Starting to consider an immersive technology strategy that outlines a suitable roadmap for virtual reality adoption would be a wise thing to do. And then if warranted, investing accordingly will be the best approach for your business. Like most things, one size won't fit all. 
What suits a major resort may not necessarily be ideal for smaller boutique hotels or even international chains. At the core of considerations and beyond the experiential aspect, hoteliers should consider the use of VR as a revenue generation tool on the customer side and a cost saving tool on the personnel and staff side of the business in order to justify the required investment. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. Until next time, it's bye for now.